SATCOM uplink enabled. <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker! What's going on everybody, it's your boy Dr. McNasty KE, and in case you ain't know, the KE stand for kill everything. So, I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I had to go into nerd mode, like seriously, I had to get my Geek Squad robe on and shit, I look, I look like a like a nerdy Hugh Hefner walking around my house over here, you know, reading manuals and, and googling stuff, because I had, um, I had some internet problems, like you can see me lagging right over here, so I'm lagging pretty bad, I'm barely, like, I'm barely moving like two feet, so I'm, and I'm teleporting over here, I'm... <laughs> Like for real, I'm uh, I'm looking like uh, I don't even know who I don't even know who teleports anymore. I don't think people teleport anymore, man. Like, it's it, it like it ain't cool no more. All the all the superheroes just fly around and shit. Nobody teleports no more. But uh, yeah, so I had to go into super nerd mode and, and stuff, and um, had to, first off I had to meditate because I was getting mad as hell. So I had to get my Mr. Miyagi on. I was getting mad as hell because I didn't know why I was lagging. So my net type went into strict automatically and. Um, I don't know. It just feels like like nowadays you have to be a biochemist, an engineer, you know, a neuro neurologist, uh, you know, plastic surgeon. You have to do all the. You have to know all this stuff just to be able to play a game. Like I miss the times when you can just pop the damn thing in and just it'll do everything for you. Like I don't remember having to do any of that stuff for any other any other prior like systems or anything like that. Like the Xbox 360. Like yeah, later on. You know, the NAT type came into question and, you know, it became something that you had to know. But for the, uh, for the uh, beginning of its life cycle with the live and everything, you didn't have to worry about that. Like, everybody could play. I remember playing Gears of War 1 before all that stuff got too complicated where everybody just jumped in. We shot the shit out of each other. You know, you played, like, against the same damn people. Like, I had a whole party full where I think back then it was, like, 4 versus 4 or something like that. And... You know, you played the same people over and over and over. We'd switch teams and all that. You talk trash, all that. And that, that's it. That was fun. To me, that was that was the, the time of my life with as far as uh, gaming is concerned. You know, nowadays you gotta you gotta be able to like I don't know to like restructure a, a Hubble telescope and all that if you want to play Xbox or PlayStation. You know, you gotta do so much stuff and you gotta be able to put up with so much crap just to be able to play your system. You have to be able to understand that, you know, three, four, five months from, from when you got that system, they're going to be uh, delivering a patch or an extra adapter or an attachment or something that's going to make your system better. Or in some cases, make your system actually work. Because, I mean, there's some systems that don't even work without an update. I mean, some people are still having problems with a each your CD. The thing will eat your CD. The game make the console makes weird noises, things like that that require an a immediate update. Look at this dude just moonwalking. Why is he? <laughs> he over there feeling himself, and this dude just taking a nap on the floor. But uh, I mean, these are the things that we got going on. I mean, back in the days, we just you got a console, and I mean, it wasn't until like the the PlayStation, I believe the PlayStation Three, and maybe even the PlayStation Two. And the Xbox 360 where we started like accepting, you know, updates and stuff like that. To us, it was cool as hell because updates and things like that weren't really like to fix a broken system. And nobody ever thought of it that way. We thought of it as it was so that uh, it was just so that they could add new features or try out features or, you know, improve the game by giving you things, you know, things like that. Nowadays, they use those features because they give you a half-assed product because they made an incredibly, like, you know, unrealistic deadline, and they they feed those deadlines to to developers and and you know 
the whole team so now they have no choice but to give you a half-assed game that doesn't work like battlefield i mean battlefield is like 60 to 80 percent unplayable there are times where i'll get into like i'll go into a server search right and i'll only find three games with people in it and this is this is only like this is like when I search like four or five different games with a wide range of uh, of selected like maps and all that stuff. And there's only about like two or three um, servers with people in it. And then there's like a hundred servers with nobody in it. And those two or three, even though they say they have open spots, they don't because the stuff don't update. Or I'll go into uh, I'll go in and like have a server like search, and nothing that I type in for that search will be in there. So nothing will actually be in there. So I'll be kind of left just wondering why the f like why the hell like my the search they didn't look for and and that pisses me off even more. Then halfway through the game, like you saw earlier on with the clips, you know the game will freeze and I'll be sitting there and I can't respawn or anything like that. I'm, you know I'm stuck waiting to see whether or not the game will end or whatever. You know and that that's dumb. And then you got the problem where halfway through the game you you just automatically get sent to the home screen, you know. And with the Xbox, I don't know if this is the same problem with the PlayStation, but with the Xbox, you know, once you go to the home screen, sometimes you'll load back in and you'll actually be able to play and because it'll it'll reload you from the home screen and sometimes it won't even do that. Sometimes it'll simply just uh it'll just uh like put you in the menu and it'll keep you on that loading screen for like forever and you'll have to actually back out use the menu button and then you know manually quit the game and start it like quit the entire game and start it all over and to me that that is just like the dumbest thing ever just for the simple fact that you shouldn't have to do all that you know and i understand that it's all like being tested but what was being tested the whole time that <laughs> you know that that we were sitting there waiting for the console like they've had about they've had about eight years to start these you know this production on these consoles they were doing all the productions the moment that they released these other consoles especially if, i mean the playstation 4 was was being like created i think like back in 05 i think it was i mean don't quote me on that but i know it was around that time frame so that is a long time from that from then until now you know and the xbox was being like the, the xbox was being worked on at this like exact same time so it wasn't nothing new you know but they're gonna act like it was and I don't want to call the developers and all that lazy just because I know exactly how much and look at this dude what the hell <laughs> yo <laughs> what's, what's going on with my buddy over here he didn't even try to help me that's the funny part right there he didn't even try to help me he's just sitting there chilling but uh and that's the stuff that we accept from people man you know and it's the reason why it's the reason why like why they get away with it it's because you know a few little smiles handshakes slight apologies that's good enough for everybody okay i know i know my people are gonna they're gonna fix it you know i believe in my team and yada 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 but at the end of the day why do we have to put up with that i don't think we do anyway let me know what you guys think man it's your boy dr mcnasty k and i'm out